good, well, it's still morning right now, but it's going to be afternoon very soon, so probably good afternoon, first block. Um, checking back in with you guys, it's Wednesday the 18th, hope you had a good Tuesday, hope you're doing all the things that, pardon me, you can do to uh, help yourself and help others in this time. <clears throat> a couple of things I wanted to start it out, thank you so much to the people who have commented so far, especially those who have commented with what they're reading. Um, I did not get to all of them, but once I post this video, I'm going to try to get to the people who commented that I didn't get a chance to respond to, but I love hearing what you're reading. Like I said, even if I haven't read it, um, I think it's awesome that a lot of you are still kind of checking in and making sure you're, you know, getting some reading in, expanding your thought process and not just kind of wasting away in a time that we, you know, probably could end up wasting a lot of time. So, um, thanks for those of you who already did. Secondly, one of the thoughts I was having today was, um, and I was talking with Mrs. Pierce about this was making sure that we take care of um, other people and check in on their on their mental health. I know that increasingly a lot of people, especially students your age, struggle with things like say, anxiety and depression. And I think it can be really tough to not have those daily outlets. And sometimes as crazy as it sounds, those daily out outlets can be school related, you know, whether it's, you know, just being at lunch with your friends or a class that you particularly like. Um, not having those can really kind of put people in a tough spot. And so I've been making it a point to try to check in on my friends and family who are, um, who I know struggle, especially when they don't have kind of that outlet. So I'd encourage you to do the same thing. Check in on your friends and family. Um, and if you're struggling, don't be afraid to reach out to somebody else. Okay. Sometimes that conversation can be all you really need to kind of point you back in a good, put you back in a good place and point you in the right direction. Um, one way that I usually try to deal with, you know, issues with anxiety and things of that nature is I've been really pushing myself to exercise more, um, getting out and running again, getting on the elliptical, um, crazy as it sounds, do, even doing yoga, um, can just put you in a spot where you feel good physically. And oftentimes when you feel good physically and put you in a better mental space. Um, so don't be afraid to do those things. And one thing that I've added a little bit to my routine occasionally is to take time for, for mindfulness or meditation. There's a lot of different apps and even like videos on YouTube that'll help you, um, you know, take a, take a moment for reflection and meditation. Um, and that can be really calming as well. So, um, you know, do something not only to check in on others, but, you know, make sure you're checking in on yourself. Um, last thing today, I'll keep it real short. Um, the, I had a, an idea um, yesterday I asked you what you were reading. Um, today I want to ask you what you are watching because I know a lot of you are you know, either watching TV or Netflix or Amazon or Hulu or Disney Plus, whatever you're streaming. Um, go ahead and, and put a comment on the classroom post, okay? So post on the assignment and tell me what you're, you're watching. Um, I'm actually, I'm really ashamed to admit this, but I'm kind of stuck in this like trashy TV circle where I'm watching a couple Netflix series like Love is Blind and a series called The Circle. I'm not proud of it and I try to really limit, but like you know, sometimes bad reality TV just draws you in. So um, I got other things in the queue that I'm actually looking forward to, to watching like um, a couple of John Green uh novels that have been turned into either TV series like uh, Looking for Alaska or, or movies. Um, I got those in the queue, so that's a little bit better in the right direction. But if you're watching something, uh, let me know what you think of it. Let me know what you're watching. Um, and again, any, any sort of interaction I'll, I'll greatly appreciate because sometimes that, like we talked about, just that interaction with others is, is helpful at a time like this. So continue to do all the things you're doing. Continue to help each other out. Check in on your friends and family. Um, and don't be afraid to reach out if you, you need to kind of talk to somebody. Um, hope you guys have a great Wednesday. Um, it's supposed to rain, but right now it looks like it's doing okay. So I hope the weather, weather's decent for you. Um, if you need anything, reach out to myself. Um, and that's all I got for you on Wednesday. So we'll check in tomorrow. See ya.